Hi, Oscar. Uh, first off, congratulations. Um, and secondly, just did you have much of a sense that the Avalanche were interested in you? And what do you think you can bring to them going forward? Uh, of course, uh, a really good city uh, and a good team I want to play with. Uh, I mean, I think my game uh, will fit in uh, with that team. Uh, so it's going to be very fun uh, to play and I can't wait. We'll go to Ron Knobenbauer, avalanche.com. Hey, Oscar, congratulations. Welcome to the Avalanche family. What are the emotions right now to know that you've been drafted by an NHL team and a team like the Avalanche with so many great Swedish players in their history? Yeah, I'm very happy. Uh, I mean, it's a very good team uh, for me to come to. Uh, yeah, so it feels so good. Uh, I can't explain it. Uh, Mike Chambers, Denver Post. Oscar, what are your plans for next season? Uh, now is the plan uh, to stay in H371 uh, in Altsvenskia. Scott McDonald, Colorado Hockey Now. Hey, Oscar, congratulations, first of all. And then, um, you know, what do you feel like you can bring to this Colorado Avalanche team um, in the future? And what are some of the skills you think you could bring? Uh, thank you. Uh, uh, I think uh, my game is going to fit in uh, to this team very good. Uh, I mean, I'm a very offensive player uh, who is very dangerous with my shot and hands. Uh, so, yeah, I'm very good uh, and dangerous in uh, the offensive zone. Eric D, Mile High Sports. Hey, Oscar, congratulations. I was just curious, have you uh, by any chance heard from, from any of the players or any of the coaches within the Avalanche or the organization? since getting selected? Uh, no, not yet. Uh, I mean, I have a lot of meetings uh, already, so maybe soon. We'll take a couple more here after Peter Baugh, The Athletic. Yeah, Oscar, it's it's pretty early in the morning over there. I'm curious, did you, have you been up all night or did you like sleep for a bit and then and get up? How do you approach that? Uh, no, now I'm uh, in Plymouth uh, with the national team. So the time is uh, 12 o'clock p.m. Uh, so, yeah, it's the night here. Last... Oh. Sorry, go ahead, Peter, if you had a follow-up. Oh, no, I was just saying that makes sense. I didn't realize that. <laughs> okay, last two here. Jeffy, the Gazette. Hey there, congratulations. Um, what was that national team gathering that we all saw? You guys all taking turns congratulating each other. Uh, what was that like tonight? Yeah, very good. Uh, I mean, spending it with my good, uh, best friends uh, is very, yeah, I'm very happy and uh, excited. And last one here for Oscar, Ron Kanabenbauer, avalanche.com. Oscar, how much did playing pro hockey last year in Sweden help you? And then as well, playing in the World Juniors, being such a young guy, playing up a level with those great players as well. Yeah, I think uh, to play against uh, men is uh, very good for me to like, yeah. Playing with men is a good step. Uh, in the World Juniors was, uh, was good because uh, I learned more how to play at uh, a little rink. Uh, it's where I'm going to play uh, yeah, soon.